Auto, July 9, 2014. This is a review of the receipt of containers and the palletization, and there are four points in this video. Come on in. So as received, we're finding the pallets to, to fail and to crack upon receipt. This is about pallets. This is about loading. This is about what customers require. The pallets that you send have a very nice density for the container. The dimensions are in inches, 44 by 38 inches. It is very suitable for a dense container. However, our customers need an outbound palletization which is different that matches rack sizes. So we have a couple of issues related to dimension. Let's go out to the uh, area. Take a look at all this. Yeah. Yeah. So this is how we stage incoming containers. This is the balance of the goods that are received. You can see that the pallets are composition pallets. And some survive, some do not. But none of these are suitable for onward presentation to the customer. Over here we have outbound shipments ready to go. Each one of these pallets are the wood, the solid wood required by our customers and we have to repackage everything that comes in in order to make the size requirement and the durability as well as the heat treat requirement by our customers. Okay. Say hello, Angel. Hello. <laughs> okay, this is our trash room. We appreciate having the protection of the goods. However, it does present a practical problem for us. We need to tear all this up. We're looking for solutions. No changes requested. This is just a, a view of how things go on our side. Over here is our collection of purchased pallets. So in the far area, these are the heat treated pallets that we've just presented a charge back invoice. They're all recycled, and they're all probably less expensive than you can get in India. Let's look at the side here, Mike. So the heat-treated pallet will always have this designation. And in order to pass customs in North America, you need to have this mark. Our best arrival condition would be on heat-treated pallets suitable for all markets with, with firm wood. Over here is the um, other purchases that we make of pallets. These are not applied for chargeback. These are everyday pallets needed to ship to our United States customers. So again, we change out the composition pallets from India and we replace them with the sea of pallets that we buy for um, standard customers. This is for our account. We would ask though that the premium treated pallets be a shared expense. Now dimensionally these pallets are 48 by 40. You'll recall that the pallets in the container were 44 by 38 in inches. Again North American customers are unable to use the dimensions of the pallets coming from India that are suitable for the dense packs that you need and so we have to we have to repack here. A little more walking. Yep, this is how we stage our incoming containers. We're getting one a day now, so it's hard to uh, put them all away. But receiving is now in the south end of the facility, generally. So in our new circumstance, we have outbound shipments in this area. Everything here is staged and ready to go. As you can see, we've got the 40 by 48 standard wood pallets ready for inspection and ready for exit. So the final point is we need to get rid of the returned goods. We have a sea of product 
that's kind of uh, in the way here. All of that in the rear um, has to go. So you can see the impact that some of the packaging from India has on our life here. This is just a, a demonstration for your well awareness and participation in changes that could help both sides. Thanks Mike for doing the video.